Each month, Colleague Giving and Fox 8 will highlight people, organizations, and charities making a difference in Northeast Ohio. It's time to celebrate Cleveland's own. Hi, I'm Matt Colleg. Hunger exists everywhere in America. Hunger does not care if you live in an urban, suburban, or rural setting. The Ben Curtis Family Foundation has taken on this challenge to eradicate food insecurity. Let's get to know Ben and Candace Curtis. Ben, Candace, thanks for sitting down with me today. It's great to be here. Ben, being on the PGA and golfing has presented you with a lot of opportunities in this world, but I would imagine that starting your family foundation has got to be one of the most rewarding things that has happened to you. Well, it has been, man. I mean, you know, we were fortunate to travel around the world and, and see some amazing places. And, you know, she growing up here in Kent, I grew up in central Ohio, I never imagined doing what I did. I mean, I always dreamed of it, but to actually have it happen was a dream come true. But the work that we've done the last seven years and here in Kent and a couple other communities has been very rewarding. And everybody says the British Open is the biggest accomplishment. I mean, to grow this to where it is today is, is obviously, it's taken a lot of time to get there, a lot of hard work, but it's very rewarding. For the viewers that don't know, Tell us a little bit about uh, what the Ben Curtis Family Foundation is. It's a feeding program where we uh, provide food over long weekends, roughly 10 times throughout the school year. It started back in 2013, and we started with 130 bags, and now we're up to 2,300 bags monthly. The bags consist of nine meals, six snacks, and as you can see here, that it's obviously easy enough for a, a kindergartner to make. And, you know, a lot of these families, they may not have a stove or they may only have a microwave. So what's in there has got to be easy enough for them to prepare for the resources that they do have. And we've been lucky working with the school district here at Kent. That's how it started. They kind of help us implement of where we should go and how we should do it. When the kids are hungry, they can't learn in the classroom. Um, you have behavioral issues and things like that. And teachers are spending their own money supplying kids with snacks in their own room. So not only are you helping the kids, you're helping teachers as well. Speak a little bit about who gets the meals. We have a liaison at each school. We call it the birdie bag liaison. It's usually a counselor or a principal, and we just check in with them every month, and they give us a number. And then the teachers put them in their lockers, and no kid is turned away. So if a teacher notices that a child needs help in their classroom, then they're just added to the list. Because a lot of these kids nowadays, they'll, they're, the only time they eat, right, is, is at school. Do you give this on the weekends, is it my understanding? Yeah. Yeah, it's usually once a month and it's usually long weekends, Thanksgiving, Christmas. Do you have plans to expand? Yeah, we'd love to, to be able to work with more school districts and, yeah. and get the word out there because, you know, every community needs it. One out of two kids yeah. in Ken is hungry. And Ravenna is at 74% and then Barberton is 78%. So they actually blanket the whole district. Every kid in the district gets a free and reduced lunch. So how can the Fox 8 viewers get involved and how can they help? If you go to our website, the BenCurtisFoundation.org, you can go on there, you can donate there. We also, we need volunteers. You know, if there's any way you can get involved, please email us, let us know, or give us a call. You are truly one of Cleveland's own, uh, doing great things in the community, and uh, it was really great to meet you guys, and uh, keep up the great work. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. To learn more about how you can help, go to bencurtisfoundation.org. Make it a great day.